assalamu alaikum today we start common collector amplifier the common collector amplifier is not different not very difference between the common meter amplifiers let's see what is a common collector in the circuit as we see that we get output across a meter through say to the couple capacitors the voltage gain cross this is again we get a v out divided by v in there v out is this one we get it from at point let's one we get output at this level so there is only a resistance re and current passes through the resistance is i e so v out is this one i e r e on the other hand v b r v in is at this stage which entered the transistor for amplification so the current passes through there is v e i e r e and r e the small r e represent we use as a ac signal not we discuss the dc signals are voltage so v in is symbolically represented by there are represented in this equation and we get the voltage gain is r e divided by r e prime plus r e as this resistance is very small as compared to the this so we can neglect it as r e divided by r e so this is equal to 1 this represent us the output voltage of meter is as the base voltage phase as a so there is no inversion of input to output this is represent us our input and this is our output so output is equal to i e r e as r e parallel to r l and therefore r e is represented in this form and this b represent us that r e prime and this r e equal to there so next is input resistance input resistance is v in divided by i in i know that v in is this one and i in is i b so i b can be changed by using this equation beta ac i b we get it from there as we put the equation there he change i e so it give the value of i e and beta ac i b i b cancel by this equation and we get r in base as r e prime is very small as compared to r e so we neglect it and r remove it then beta ac is equal to r e r in total is basically r1 parallel to r2 parallel to r in base r the resistance are parallel to each other if we see in the main diagram like this r1 r2 r in base all of these resistance are parallel so output resistance we get rs 
divided by beta AC parallel to RE. This question can be derived by using this derivation of selected equation. You can use the net and find how he find this output resistance. Now the current gain is a i e divided by i e or i in i in is v in over r in r total while r in total is represent there on the other hand power gain now the power gain is nearly equal to the current gain because the voltage gain is equal to 1 and now we complete the common collector amplifier there he used just how to make the buffer of the speakers he represented us we used two transistor for more clear and clear and high amplifications he just used this topic you read it if you have any problem you can ask me but you must I suggest you after each topic you must be read carefully the every example if you solve solve these examples you were able to understand the most of the topics now we get more common base amplifiers in common base amplifier same but we get the output across collector and we get output at this point while we give the input at meter now the voltage gain is V out equal to V out sorry I removed it V out divided by V in there V out is VC and V in is VE VC is equal to simple simply IC RC on the other hand V is equal to IE RE prime parallel to RE like there there is a small re small re is belonging to the internal resistance re prime so it is parallel to re and we get the output there the voltage gain is equal to ie e rc divided by ie by cancellation ie rc divided by re prime parallel to re and this one is given as re very small as compared to re capital so the voltage gain is av equal to rc or re prime and rc is parallel to rc and rl these two resistance are parallel so this is the combining resistance of uh, these effects input resistance input resistance in r in at meter is v in over i in v in is v e or i e v e is equal to as we discussed it in previous by cancellation there we get re prime parallel to re while re is very much larger as compared to this on the vn method re can be neglected because it is very small as compared to 
the value of re is very small as compared to re prime so the r in r in a meter resistance is equal to this one next output resistance we know that output is equal to r output is equal to rc now the current gain there the current gain is ie is equal to 1 because the collector current is nearly equal to the meter current so current gain is equal to now the power gain is equal to the voltage gain because the current gain is 1 there is the example related to above topic you must be read it by carefully multi-stage amplifier we add the as many amplifier as we can for getting our required result so this is the example there I can mention you this is the way in by using a capacitor we put again this input as a input to the same other stage second stage this is our first stage this is a second stage and we get the output after that which is more effectively there he discuss again when AC output or AC voltage gain current gain everything it uh, represented okay I think there is no, not a more difficult things for discussing the basic differential amplifiers we can read it by yourself and if you have any problem you can ask me I try to explain everything which I know this is these topics are not very difficult if you read the above topics if you want to get my lecture on this topic comments me and tell me which topic you want for more details thank you